Thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Taylor Swift's longtime BFF and collaborator Jack Antonoff weighed in on the exodus of Scooter Braun's superstar clients. The Bleachers lead singer who recently tied the knot with Margaret Qualley shared a meme from The Sims game via his Instagram story Sunday. The image showed a female Sim staring at a computer while her baby Sim lies on the floor in flames. The text read, Not now, sweetie. Mommy is trying to figure out why Ariana Grande, Demi Lovato and Adina Menzel just fired Scooter Braun as their manager. Antonoff's post comes nearly a week after Page Six confirmed Demi Lovato had parted ways with Braun and his talent management company, SB Projects, in July. Adina Menzel also ended her professional relationship with Braun in January, per The Hollywood Reporter. It has also been rumored that Justin Bieber, who has worked with a talent manager since 2006, was calling it quits with Braun. Despite the Yummy Singer's reps shutting down reports, other sources told Page Six where there's smoke, there's fire. Additionally, Billboard reported last week that Ariana Grande was seeking new management after 10 years with Braun, 42. However, a source denied the rumors, telling Page Six that Braun and the position's songstress are still working together. A second source familiar with the situation clarified that Grand, 30, and Bieber, 29, were not leaving SB projects, but rather Braun was taking a step back. All of Scooter Braun's clients are under contract, and negotiations have been going on for several months, as Scooter steps into his larger role as Hive America's CEO, the insider told us. SB projects are still handling both Justin and Ariana, as they work through what this new structure looks like. Of course, Swift, 33, publicly slammed Braun back in 2019 after he acquired the rights to her master recordings. Scooter has stripped me of my life's work that I wasn't given an opportunity to buy, she wrote in a lengthy Tumblr post at the time. Essentially, my musical legacy is about to lie in the hands of someone who tried to dismantle it. Even though Braun later sold the masters for more than $300 million in 2020, the business move prompted the pop superstar to re-record her first six albums. So far, she has re-released 2008's Fearless, 2010's Speak Now and 2012's Red, all of which Antonoff, 39, helped produce.